Hey guys, it's it's been a great time catching all of you after a break and thank you so much and all uh, for all of your love and uh, your uh, likes, your shares and please request you to just like and share and comment and uh, please uh, dislike also if you don't like my videos. There's nothing uh, to hide. The main thing about this channel is to present, uh, give you an opinion and give you a point of view to go ahead in life and to add something or other daily in the way of professional life, personal life, relationship, uh, financial careers or educational career, uh, careers uh, other than uh, like this, like passions, dreams. So a collection of this is what is this channel doing and I am doing to be frank. So today's discussion is as you have seen like nowadays OTT versus cinema theaters is the most biggest discussion. So first of all let's see why is OTT more preferred than the cinema theater. For example if you are going for a cinema theater it is located far from your home like uh, around 5-6 kilometers from your home. You go in an auto and uh, on, uh, especially uh, mostly you go on a weekday weekends. So that time minimum rate is around 50 rupees for an auto. That time for going to a theater only 100 rupees is over for you. If uh, Imagine like you are a family, a wife, uh, two kids. So four people. Four people and if you are going to a normal theater also nowadays the ticket is 120 to 150. 150 into 4 600 plus this auto 700 plus the taxes inside and popcorns whatever you buy. Minimum is how much? 1000 rupees are gone in one day. This is the major reason people are preferring OTT. If you click like subscribe for an OTT for a 3 months you get around uh, less than 600 only right like uh, most of the things like uh, AHA, Alu Arjun's like ARHA productions uh, for 3 months they charge around uh, 400 or something not uh, less than 500 grace I am telling you 499 or 399 that's it. Netflix also I had recently taken like Netflix if I, uh, I can watch on my phone I can watch on uh, TV basic for 1 month is 100 and uh, 96 rupees so it's like that so I am telling you is that the difference between things how cinema theaters uh, are plus than OTT if you take cinema theaters if you are watching a cinema imagine you can see the magic of cinema when there's a dark light everything is dark you see a hero or you see a soldier coming out of uh, fire and you see a national flag any movie like you uh, emerging like uh, oh my god a normal man can do this much this things right you can only experience in the theater so that's the reason people are telling theater is a magic it gives the ability to imagine it gives the ability to dream it gives the ability to become a fan a hero or an artist or a writer whoever worked for this film he gives his sweat here and blood for the movie so there are so many negatives like piracy is there, internet, uh, they keep the links and uh, and uh, some people, distributors don't buy their films. So they are all fighting to be honest with you. 2% of success rate today's movie industry whether Hindi, Tamil, Telugu, Malayalam, whatever the language it may be. Within one week if the movie is good, two weeks that's it maximum. We have never seen a 50 days function nowadays. Why? Everyone wants to go to OTT only. OTT is great, OTT is forever, but the magic of cinema is seen only in theatre. Imagine if you are seeing a, imagine like simple example, if you are having a party in a theatre, buying popcorn, treat, giving a treat to your friends with samosa, chai and all, like watching, like coke and all, watching a theatre movie, doing like a whistling and that paper things and all coins, you put it in the air when hero is coming. If you do the same thing in your home, how it will be? You will get whacked up and you will be thrown out of the house. Who will clean all this first thing where my mother. But so, but what I tell is like, okay, like OTT versus cinema should be there. Always cinema, there should be always an update for something. Like you are only there, like right? today you do some courses, you will do some, uh, you want to learn new things, you want to go up ahead in life, you want to be number one. The same way cinema, this one helped in the pandemic for the many new comers where you don't have the distributors, you won't have that uh, people buying and by selling cinema like if you, anyone is not giving you a theatre you can go to the OTT but what is the discussion is many people uh, nowadays are preferring OTT OTT is good, OTT is portable, you can watch in a mobile, you can watch in a TV which increase really the percentage now anybody can view cinema from anywhere that's the best thing about OTT 
but some movies are meant for theater theater experience is the best experience so thank you guys and please do make your comments and let's meet again for with another topic thank you so much guys